Hey y'all, it's Gretchen, it's Saturday, and we are talking about women in movies. Yay, I love movies. In fact, I've got my Netflix right here waiting to be returned. Mira Nair is fantastic, and she's somebody I've followed for a long time. Probably seen Monsoon Wedding. If you haven't, run to Blockbuster or run to your Netflix queue and add it. Monsoon Wedding. I think it's important and that we put ourselves on screen and put our stories on screen, but I always think it's vital to do it as excellently as possible, you know? And, um, and that's what I try and do. I love how she breaks the mold without going too far and really depicts this family as just, just loving and uh, nurturing and the colors are amazing, the, 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 the dances, the, the music. Um, there's a scene where all the women are gathered before a wedding and they're singing and they're dancing and they're clapping and it's just, it warms my heart because I wish I had that community and it's so wonderful to see it on film. She also made a movie called If you've seen Slumdog Millionaire, which I did a couple weekends ago, amazing, loved it, um, breaks your heart. Salam Bombay is kind of the precursor to that movie, and it, it's, it's even more hardcore, I think. Um, and I saw it a long time ago, and it, it has stayed with me for a very long time. So Miranair, love her, kisses, love her. Um, I also and made last, a movie called Salam Bombay. Um, I want to talk about Adrian Shelley. Um, I hope y you've seen the movie Waitress. This spring... You look tragically cute in your uniform. Nobody ever notices me in that way. Maybe we could have a coffee or something. I can't have coffee. It's on the bad food list you gave me. What kind of doctor are you? What if he's Prince Charming? I don't want my husband to kill me pie. Hold the banana. Carrie Russell is tartly irresistible in this vibrant American comedy that celebrates life, liberty, and a woman's pursuit of happiness. You're not just some little waitress. Start fresh. It's it's very heartwarming. It's very well done. The dialogue is fantastic, and it was written, directed, and acted by the lovely Adrian Shelley. I wrote Waitress when I was about eight months pregnant with Sophie, and I was really scared about having a baby. I just couldn't imagine what my life was going to be after I had a baby. I thought it was going to change so drastically that I wasn't even going to recognize myself anymore. I was terrified. The actual fear of how your life is going to change, which is large in a lot of women, is not spoken about. It's sacrilege to say that, you know, becoming a mother is you're not allowed, you're just not allowed to have a fear about it. So I, I wanted to write a movie about those fears and, you know, give those fears a voice. But I also... Her husband started a foundation called the Adrian, Adrian Shelley Foundation, and it's, it's designed to help women find that voice. It's helping to fund independent films, student films, and to get women behind the camera um, and not just in front of it. And I thought that how inspiring that, that that's your legacy. I think the movie has a really lovely heart. I really like putting that sort of thing out in the world. That's important to me. I have been very moved and, and um, inspired by actresses. But to have those be your words, to have that be your vision, and leave your legacy with those around you as wanting to uplift other women in film, you know, that's, that's inspiring to me. Go check these, this stuff out. Um, explore, do, create, be, love, watch. Go see a film. Get a Netflix. Movies. Where all things are possible. Have, make it a great week.